This is my prayer for America. Gee, Jesus, I'm scared. I'm gonna lose my Medicaid. Jesus, I'm scared. I'm, ha I'm having a stroke. I'm scared. I live without being able to afford my medications. Jesus, I beg you to have mercy on this nation. Turn the station back to you. I beg you. You see the presidential candidates? I call them dumb and dumber. Why, God, didn't you inspire Rush Limbaugh or Newt Gingrich to run for office or somebody who knows what's going on? Somebody who could lead this and have leadership capability. Why didn't you let me run for president? Why? God, I'm begging you. Please let Hillary Clinton have a stroke and put her out of the rest of her life. She does not set foot in the White House ever again for the rest of her, of her life. Let her get saved, but please let her have a stroke. Jesus and Donald Trump. My spider sense is tingling about him too. Please get somebody in that overlock. Please leave this nation. Please, I beg you, have mercy on this country. Have mercy on me. I just want there be to be in America 35 years where I can still get my medication. Please let me fulfill my three dreams, Jesus. If you're going to do this, you can have me in my life. But again, I please, please get Hillary out of the way, Lord. Please let her have a stroke. I don't care. Just dementia, Parkinson's. Please get her. Please, please, Jesus, for this country's sake, for your sake, please get her out of the way. Get her out of the, Don't let her set foot in that white house, please. I pray fervently as I can, Lord. Please let her have a stroke. Please don't let me have a stroke. But please let Hillary Clinton have a stroke. And all things are possible with you, so he is going to take a miracle. Please get somebody besides Donald Trump, a real leader, in that office. Unless, of course, he will leave this nation. I think he's a professional politician. A Machiavellian politician. An expert politician. Not a citizen, U.S. More, more than a U.S. citizen. I don't know.